You haven't seen what you want manifest yet, and it's hard to believe that it's actually going to happen, that you can avoid basing the future on the past. But then you realize, I better shift that belief so that I can create space for the potential of this thing. Here is three things you can do to help shift that belief. And the first one is a process called submodality belief change through neurolinguistic programming. You might be able to find that online, but you can always check in with me. It's something I do frequently with myself and my clients. And the second one is a practice that I did as part of a feminine embodiment program with John Wyland, where you take the old belief and you feel it completely in your body. You act it out through movement, through sound, and then you do the same with the new belief that you want to have. Lastly, pay more attention to yourself rather than what's happening outwardly. Make sure that you've done the self-reflection, the self-growth work so that you feel confident that you're doing the best that you can do. And then you can be more outcome independent since we can't really control what happens in life. And just know that you inside yourself are in the right place. Blessings.